Okay, I'm making this video to show you how to white out something that's in a PDF document in a program called Foxit Reader, which is free to download. Um, I'm going to double click on this PDF document and it's going to open up in Foxit Reader. And I'm going to try to white out this word sling. And the way you do it is you hit you go up to the these see these tabs across here, go to the comment tab, and then go to this rectangle. Now I'm not going to click that rectangle yet. I want you to notice that something's going to pop up right about here when I click the rectangle. I'm clicking it now. Okay, it's actually right here. Notice that this drawing tool, this is very odd, but this is the way it works. It popped up here. Now I'm going to click on the drawing tool and it's going to show me some colors here. So click here on drawing tool. And now you want to change two things. You want to make sure that the line color is white. Go to the drop down menu and here's white. I'm going to click that and you want to go to the color fill tool or the fill color tool go to the drop down menu and right now it's red we want to change that to white once the fill color and the line color are both white it's going to create a rectangle that's white so as I hover over the document now you see these crosshairs and I'm going to go to the top left of sling click the left mouse button drag until I get to the bottom right of the word and let go now that's whited out now, if you want to make sure that the person who receives the PDF document that you send them can't use some advanced tool to potentially look at the things that you've whited out, what you need to do now is print print this document to a PDF. Uh, so, I don't know, I haven't tried this yet on here. But, uh, okay, so micro print to Microsoft PDF. That's the default printer. Most likely yours, when you go to here, will be your printer that you print, you know, to paper. But this is a virtual printer. So what it's going to do is going to print this document in a manner where the whiteout portion cannot be undone by some other advanced PDF editor. So now I'm going to click OK. It's probably going to ask me where I want to save that. I'm hoping. Um... Okay, yeah, that's what it's doing. I'm just going to call this file2.pdf, or the PDF will be there. Just file2 and save. And it looks like I saved it to my desktop, so it's printing to that virtual printer. Now I should have a file on my desktop called file2pdf. And when I open it up, you, know, you notice that Sling is nowhere to be seen here. And if the person you email this to had an advanced PDF editor and tried to edit this file, they wouldn't be able to look at what you've whited out. And that's it.